Hey, morning, Dad. Just spoke to you, actually, and you were pretty excited. Gonna show you where I'm at. There's a landing craft from World War II. That would scare the ever-living shit out of me to have to come out of the back of one of them. Uh, you guys did it. Here we are in Falls River, Massachusetts. They're doing some renovating. We're underneath the bridge, which is weird. But, there's a battleship. She's got all sorts of stickers up there, don't she? BB-59, Massachusetts. And the Joseph P. Kennedy Jr. is there. You know how to hit pause, Dad, in case you want to read all that. That ain't gonna help you if I'm going backwards, is it? It's a big ass ship. It's down there, too. I don't know what the lionfish is. That must be the sub that they're still working on over here and they have been for a long time. Fast and the Furious, huh? The PT boats. And she's a big son of a bitch. Torpedo boat exhibit hunt. They had one of those little plaques right there for the lionfish, too. The sub. Oh, did they? Can't get on it because it's still. But one of the ships here, the Massachusetts, a big one back there. We got free run. Can all go all the way down. This one's kind of set up. Oh, look at that. To keep you away. And here we go. Ain't no goddamn way that's a PT boat. Is it? Must be. There's something down here. That's a PT boat? I mean, I get it with this here. What are those? You, you could tell me, Dad. Are these, uh, are these like laws or RPGs or... Hey, you want to go up? PT-617. It is a PT boat. Are you shitting me? Well, I guess compared to them ones out there, that is a pretty lightweight boat, huh? I mean, at least up to the deck. I don't think you can get on it, but you can get up there and see. Yeah, I told Dad where we were, and he's like, oh, yeah, they're pretty nice, ain't they? Like, really? Is there anywhere I can go he hasn't been? 37 millimeter. I ain't never shot one of them, Barbara. Look, see if there's some ammo down there. Huh? What is, what is that one, Dad? After you watch it, give me a call and let me know. Is that comparable to like the Mountain Mauser or? Jesus. See that torpedo tube <laughs> on this little ass boat? Dual 50 cals. In the middle and the back. Look at that one. Oh wow. You can see down in there, the boys had their pin-up girls. God damn, really is a PT boat. I didn't think they were that big. I know Dad shot one of them. But I shot a 40 millimeter. They're something they're never going to do away with. Yeah, that's a PT boat. You doing good? 
Because you got a lot of walking. Oh, yeah. Woo! If you ever watch any of these videos, Brian Stewart, I bet you worked on a bunch of them. A Packard. God, look how fast that thing was. Wow. Jesus. Looks like there's another one right over there. Yeah, there's one. Two of them. Is there? Yeah. James Newberry, who founded PT Boats. That one's closed off. Closed off. This is another PT boat. Oh, they're winterized. They're winterized. Still freaking 70 degrees out down here. Southerners. We'll start with the little boat. Huh? Start right here? No, with the little boat. Oh. Nice little walkway through here. It's a little loud because of the highway there, but that's why we came down here. The Joseph Kennedy Jr. That's what that one is. You can get on down there, come up here and go right inside, Barbara. Yep. Or you can get inside there too. Is that exciting? I know you like that stuff. Let me pull this. I'm gonna put this in my pocket. It's 390 feet. With 288 men lived on that one, Barbara. 18 officers and 270 enlisted. Says who is Joseph at P. Kennedy Jr. Ah, oh, there's the lionfish. What? That sub was as long as this boat. Really? Almost. All right. So you want to go on the Kennedy first? Yeah. Okay. Uh -huh. There's Chow Hall. Right here, hon. This isn't the big boat. Look at that. That's the big boat? Okay. Yeah, that's the Massachusetts. This is the This is the Kennedy right here. They, they got it all roped off or they don't want you to go. That's a step down. I just shit myself. Yeah, that's why I stayed to grab you. Wait, can you feel the boat moving? Look at the wheels on the deck. Oh, wow. No, I can't feel it moving. It, well, it's not that thing that's solid steel moving. I ain't going up there. No, you ain't going up there. Well, there's stairs over there to get up. We will. We'll go around over there. Go ahead. Thought they were heavier than that. That's the post office, huh? <laughs> My claustrophobia, there ain't no goddamn way. I live on the deck. Huh? Yep. Yeah. Nah, that's not true. You got all Marlboros, Camels, Lucky Strikes, Lucky Strikes, Winchesters, and Marlboros and Camels. Don't have any. You okay, babe? Am I? Yeah. So far.
I still feel the breeze because they have it open like a wind yeah. tunnel. I can't, I'm not seeing like any of the stuff. I just got video of your butt. Korean conflict. Yeah. Chair of honor for the POWs. You got damn right. So we're not going to the lower decks? <laughs> Are you teasing me about my claustrophobia? No, I'm just... I, I really don't want to go to the lower decks. I might go. You are now crossing the 38th parallel. Courtesy of the 7th Cavalry, Gary Owens. <sighs> Army guys from Korean... There's a Vietnam Memorial. Why don't you let me go in front of you? Alright. All I'm getting is video of your butt. Do I go out on the deck? No, I wanna finish. Stay inside? Yeah. Weird how they had all these pictures just hanging here during the war. They didn't. <laughs> oh! That's where the magic happened. Fuck, I could study them knots all day. There's so many of them I don't know. I do see a double arc set though, that one's easy. So if we're diving, I'm out. Electronic shop. An engineering department. Can't see shit. Oil and water testing. Not going that way. Or that one. Oh. The infirmary. I have one of them blankets. I like the music. Dispersing office. Pay me. Why? Bean counters. Oh, yeah. oh, the office. He might have spent some time in there being in trouble. Forward engine bay. Not a chance. We're sitting here just floating in the ocean. Your son ain't going down in that goddamn thing. Laundry room. Once we get out on the deck, we'll get you somewhere to sit for a little bit. Pass. No, thank you. Uh -huh. <laughs> you go right ahead. Ah. Oh. They ain't changed in a long ass time. Still the same kind of grill, same kind of oven, steamer, stock pots. That's tape but broken. 
So somebody went up there. Whippets whipping cream. You know they did bad things with them, Dad. The highfalutin. I guess that's it. We turn around and go back. That's all. Oh shit. <sighs> yeah, the division commander's stateroom. My pants are falling down. Well, if you could not on my video and get me, you know, in trouble. Obviously. Oh. Oh. Holy shit. I won't be the dude working in there. Yeah, I think you actually end up having to go all the way up, Barbara. Radar room. Transmitter. What the shit, man? Everything was really packed right in. What is that? We got that radio gear. Oh, wow. Hmm. Alright, so we gotta go. Guess what? We gotta go back down. The years of service of mine, yes, covered a period of about 35 years, of which. Uh, some 32 were as a commission officer in the Navy. Uh, the changes are, I'm going to make my way down. Okay, hon. Needless to say, many of them are very obvious to anybody. That, uh, the, the, That's the uh, captain's uh, cabin right there. The Navy and the uh, general line duties of the Navy is a big change in the Navy. But Kennedy's most unique experience in time, I think it's safe to say, was our deployment to the Far East during the Arab-Israeli War in 1967. We had left Newport in uh, the early part of the year and deployed on a six-fleet deployment, knowing in advance we were going All right, to... got to go back down. We'll Arab start back up again in a minute. All right, here we are on the other side, Dad. This is a lionfish. It's got a 40 millimeter. You don't even really feel it move. Uh -oh. I mean, it's not as big as a cruise ship and you still don't feel it move. You want me to go in front of you? Nope. Should be open deck, right? Yeah. Yeah. Windier shit, open deck. Yeah, there's stairs down there. That's what I figured. Yeah, I'm, just, I'll wait for you.
When we came, we came up there and we walked all the way down. No, we snuck that door. We, we came in the first door. You good? Yeah, I'm good. I knew there were ghosts on this ship. <laughs> so she's been tied off for a while, huh? Look at the barnacles and stuff growing yep. on them. That used to be open, I guess, so that you could look in there. Looks like it's closed off. It is. You can head back that way, huh? Okay, I'm gonna get the other side, uh, over to the big ship. We'll start again. Wouldn't go over to the submarine. Why not? Do you think that sub is somewhere your husband should be? Huh? No. Jesus, look how big this is. Walter B. Peterson. This is a young cat. That's how he's off, right? Yeah, but... Yeah, it's for the shot. You want the shot? You want the shot? You've probably seen all this before, Dad. Yeah, gotta remember to hold the phone upright. Makes for better video. And you can see it better instead of this goddamn one. Got your map? Because we're going to get lost as shit. It's in my pocket. They're going to have to find us at closing time. The size of that gun. There's a bird up on top of that one. <laughs> Away from there. Why? Because I said bay fleets. There's a ladder to go down. There's a boat. There's a deck down there. Come on. Barbara. There's a whole ass platform. Uh. I think that's what we go down in. Oh, there's arrows. Avenge Pearl Harbor. You better get your old ass out from underneath there. Huh? Just yeah? Yeah. It looks like engine or something. 
Ain't no goddamn way. It says enter here. I'm not getting in there. Uh, where, where, where's the sign that says exit here? Because it's tight in here. Come on out. Eric, don't go up in there. You'll get stuck in there. You didn't get your head in here and see it, did you? No. Okay. Eric. Yes, dear. You're the one that's supposed to focus, not me. <sighs> I know, but it's like big in here. Stinks. Yeah, smells like steel and diesel, man. The turret booth. I hear people talking, but you ain't got no idea where they are. Oh, they're on a TV screen in there. Okay. Let's find out if I can do this. Or if this is where I live now. Who are you talking to? You. I can't hear you. I said, let's find out if I can do this or if this is where I live now. I'm not out yet. Huh? Remember the ducks. You standing right there in the way is super helpful. That must have helped great. Oh, look at Look at the sweat. I told you not to go in there. I started shitting my pants immediately. I told you not to go in there. Oh. See where they sat? Huh? Yeah. Where? Right down here, hon. On that? Yeah, seats there. Oh, There's all their pedals for up, down, left, well, right. That's where the seat used to be. Huh? That's where the seat used to be. Right. That's just for that guy who's sighting shit in. Somebody else was giving her hell. Look, the drawbridge is open again. I don't know if you can see it. Nine around loves drawbridges. Oh. Okay. What? That's the way. Oh, shit. You don't gotta go in. You can just get a picture right here. Another old ass generator. Oh, MK5, what is that, the pack room? Is that what it is, like a pack room? Oh, time for us to get lost. Yeah. What time do they close? <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, this way first. Oh. Oh. Down there, student orientation room is down there. All right, we're gonna get in the. They can have it. <laughs> we're going down. <laughs> they can have the student orientation room, Barbara.
holding the plasma bottle in one hand and firing his pistol with the other. He single-handedly repulsed the first wave. I shot everyone I could find. I, I was, you know, they had me and I was protecting the patient and protecting myself. But in the meantime, uh, the patient was getting strong enough to where he stood up. And once he stood up, he, he, he gave away my position, his position as well. And down comes the man issues. The first one I took out this eye and then he came down in the chest and I had a sucking chest pain. Despite his critical wounds, he fought on, killing at least six of the enemy. And joined by other Marines, he resumed treating the wounded until finally collapsing from his own severe injuries. On 10 February 1970, Not exactly sure where my wife just went. Are you going off by yourself? So you have the map. You're gonna go off by yourself. Can't read a map worth of shit. So we're both gonna be lost, huh? So this is, must have been the mess hall. Sure is. If I've ever seen one, this one's it. Hey, this one's supposed to be open in half an hour, and they got sodas and stuff. Oh really? Yep. They'll, they'll have stuff for you to drink. Supposed to be open in like half an hour. That's a men's room. Like oh. literally men's room. Hey, right here, men's room. Look, woo, men's room. Yeah, that's right there. But that's a fire exit. There's stairs going down. Okay. I'm coming. Why you got? Why you gotta go down? Cause you can't go anywhere else. Well, I mean, like, what about right here? Hmm. It looks like it's, it's just, it's just a, huh? It's wide open down here. Yeah, it's a larger ship, but it's just like a, uh, maintenance room. This is another, uh, another, this has to be. It's more of a pillow, really. I hear you. I know you hear me. The whole ship hears me. It resounds through here. Come on down. Don't tell me how to live my life, okay? I'm a huge fan of going inside tuna cans. Why don't Lots of air. Shut up. I live in the woods. Go this way first. Huh? Oh, look at this big American flag. The bunk room? What? This humongous American flag. I don't know. I think it's still pretty glorious, Barbara. It is. Oh, there's more fences. Uh, hey, don't keep taking off. It's just one room. I found a bench to sit at. Okay. <clears throat> That's the Pearl Harbor room. The next one is the D-Day invasion room. You scared shit out of me, my dude. <laughs> well, there was somebody standing there. That dude almost got knocked out standing there just staring at my wife. Pow! Wouldn't be the first time these halls have seen some violence. What? I just told you that was there. Um, 
Ouais. Ouais. Hein? Yeah, combat engineers like Chuck. They'd use these little bullshits here to tug that stuff around. Yep. And the Coast Guard had. No smoking. Shouldn't be smoking in here anyway. This ship has had enough smoke. Cross of Lorraine. Huh? I don't. I. I need you to. Jesus, Barbara. What? I didn't know where you went. I thought you went that way. I was going around it. No, you gotta do this. I'm following the arrows backwards. Good, good. You're doing great. Oh. Wonder what's in there. Wonder how much that has changed. Any chance you watch one of these, Claude? You let me know how much those has changed. Do you see this, where it got shelled? And how thick, huh? Where it got shelled, and there's a big hole through the steel, and they put a chunk oh, no, of it. I didn't see that. Yeah, because you're just running, man. Because I was on the other side. Jesus. Jesus. Oh, That's where it came from? Well, there was. How did you get up to the top once we turned out well? Climb. Right here, man. Hand, hand, go. I'm trying to find the beginning of these arrows. I think that's the easy way. Of the what? The beginning of the arrows. Oh. Oh, Guardian class. Barbara, Where? this is what you were asking about. The radar picket ship. It's a Guardian class ship. Oh, wow. Yeah, we're somewhere all the way down here underneath it in the middle of the ocean right now. Are we? Yeah. They haven't even gone down two levels yet. There's like six. Oh, fuck. I should have brought an ice pack. Well then. Hmm? All the uniforms. The women's uniforms. Let's see the month monthly pay. Apprentice seaman, fifty dollars a month. That was a lot back then. But they got a food allowance of fifty-four and a quarters allowance of thirty-seven. So they got a hundred and forty-one total dollars a month. Petty officers got up to $217. Wow. Well, all right, can't go up that. That's not up. No matter how many times you say it to try and make me oh, feel better, that. that's not up. That. Okay. Oh, the women. Yeah. I thought you'd want to spend a minute looking at the vagina power things. No. I'm good. No, you're not a feminist. Winnie and Rosie were. Rosie's the one on all the... She's got her arm flexed. Now that noise you hear could be clear at the other end of the ship. Just echoing through. So think about when the guys were trying to sleep. There's the women. And somebody's... Doing the telephone. Somebody drops a goddamn can on the other end of the ship and it wakes you up. Huh? Oh, wow. Uh, 
standard Liberty ship and boxed air cat craft transport. This way, babe. Uh, just, I'm going that way. This way we came in. I would just want yeah, to see this. Oh, got arrows on the ground for fire exit. Came through here on the other side. A smaller bunk room? Yep. yep. Bunk room five and bunk room seven. I kind of like this one. You kind of like that one? Yeah. Why? Because I feel like I could chew my way through the wall and we're still above the waves. Yeah. Yeah, because I'm a weirdo and a freak. <laughs> there ain't no goddamn way. You know what that Nautical Knights program is? What? Huh? Kids come and stay here with parents. You want to come with Miss, Miss Nai Nai and stay on the ship? No. <laughs> huh? No, no, thank you. I'm ready to bunk room 11. It comes out down at the end. Look at that. Ooh! Poppy. Hmm? So what? The potty. Oh, the pisser. Oh, at least they got a mattress. Must have been like the... Private chambers? Yeah. That's for warrant officers and staterooms, Barbara. Look at that. More mattresses. More mattresses. Yeah, but there's... Fucking two of them in that little ass. I'd rather, rather be in the bunkhouse if I had to share a room that small. Danger, confined space, pass. <laughs> you want to touch the mattress? It's a dining hall. Hey. Why would I touch the mattress? It's Looks like one out of a truck. Yeah. It's like a this tractor trailer a sleeper. For the officers. Yeah, this is gonna be nicer. Way nicer. Alright, here's more down. More down? Yep. Alright, I wait this I thought this was the way we came in. No. But that's the way out. Okay. Just follow the arrows. You're right oh, right. Yeah, well, I can hear you. Right. Yeah. Are you sure? Well, I'm saying if that was the way we came in. Yeah. Then we walked right around this one. I don't remember that. Oh, neither. I don't think we came in that. We came in over here. Over there. Okay. Dental and radio shack. So don't you want to finish this deck first and see what's up I here? Don't want to go down. Why? Because. You want to finish this deck first yeah, and see what's I, up here? I don't want to go down. So you're going to send me down there by myself? No. I want to find a better... There's no other way down, Barbara. A better stairs. That's a long typing room. Holy crap, are those some big chugger pumps. That's like five times the size of the ones I use. Those are a non-positive displacement uh, bladder pump. Oh, really? We use them to pump 
mostly chemical and stuff out of our waste oil tanks. Oh. Air driven. We have to have an air compressor for it to work. I wouldn't mind that one either. How you doing, babe? I feel a breeze. So you good? There's a vegetable locker, so it's got to be. I can feel the humidity. Did you see that? Kill where I was here. Yeah, it's got to be humid and dark. Canned goods. Nope, those aren't. That's like oils and grease so, and stuff. The incinerator. Boomby boomby. <laughs> huh? You going in? Do you want to see it? What the shit is? where I would have been stuck. Nope, right here is where I would have been stuck. You know what this line is for, don't you? Take the food. Under bad conditions. Hamburger patties with gravy. Hey, look at the mashed potatoes with the spiders. That'll take it. 100%. Okay. Entering the PT boat exhibit. Stop doing that. Stop doing what? Uh. Oh, God damn. Bow and arrow. That's it. That's that PT. I'll go down that one. No, pick that one. Before. Pick one. Yeah. Yeah. Oh shit. Bronze Star, Purple Heart, Armed Forces Reserve, Defense, Campaign, Asiatic. WW2. Wonder if they thought that that music was really swinging.
Oh, the P-51 Mustang. What's that room? Solid room. Solid room. Oh, that's stupid. It was supposed to be a rail gun, Hitler, you dumbass, not a railroad gun. <laughs> Here's a PP gun. We take a piss in it to cool it down. What is it, aircraft? That was a massive ship. Aircraft carrier. It was a massive ship. Yeah. Right here, Barbara. Whoa. That's what hit you? No, my unit had two of those. That's only that's only the uh, 155. You gotta look for a 209. Look at that ship. Okay. I'm going here and check this out before I go that way. Okay. Because this looks like the end of this. Shit. Made out of brass or what? St. Paul? Huh? What are you doing? Get down. Come here, here. Just get down. Here. Just get down. Oh, look. 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 You didn't use the step. Just step over it. There's no higher than the gate. You walk over to hide from the dog. Princess Rhea. Going up that or back out? Back out. Shit is at a gun sight. Shitty, shitty, shitty. Another one right here. Oh. More zoomies. Oh, there's the nice laundry. Huh? There's laundry. Yeah, and there's a bench. We'll have a seat. Dad and I both like the planes. Ha <laughs> the duck. Ooh. Is that a warthog? I can tell by the chair. G4M? Yeah. Yeah, what's a G4M? I have no idea. Huh? No idea. They had a bunch of Hawker Hurricanes over there too. There was other Hawkers. There was like a Typhoon and um, I think there was actually a couple more. Messerschmitt 110. Who's a Hinkle Dad? And a Dormer. Dormer 215. Decent plane. I think this is as far down as you can go. I think I am perfectly okay with that. I have gone down as far as I need to. You want to have that up? The way that steps somewhere. There's an Apache. Besides, it's almost like lunch, and I just have lunch, Banshee. How do you know Banshee sweat, Barbara? I don't know. It's just a phrase. There's the steps right there. Ouch. Yeah, so are you good then? You don't want to go any further? 
It's whatever you want. This barber. Yeah, there was a barber right here. I could use a haircut. Did, oh, you did what I told you to? No, you didn't. Look, it's not as high as the gate at home. Step over it. What? The jail. The brig. Stop it, Barbara. People are going to see this. Call it the damn jail. Barbara. Touch nothing. He's in jail. <laughs> why did you have, why did you smile when you said that? Because I don't gotta bail him out. Hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. Close. 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 Get <laughs> your ass out of here. They got it locked for a reason for wives. That's what they call it, the wife room. <laughs> Still don't know why you smiled though. He's in jail. He's in jail. Yeah. He's in jail. His ass is out of here. He's in jail. Glenn Ford and Ernest Bornine. Torpedo run. Cary Grant? Jesus, this is a big ship, but still not when you had when they had twenty five people living or twenty five hundred people living here. Do you yeah. see what the skeleton of it looks like? Wow. Yeah, that can kiss all of my ass. I'm not going down. Oh, there's one more level. Hey, shut your pie hole. I haven't seen any steps going down, and we don't even know where we're at. No. There's the big brass ass ship. There's no way out over there. We gotta go back this way. I already looked. I can hold that. Well, there's stairs going up. Yeah, we gotta go up. Not down? Not down. Oh. Oh, honey. I told you this was the last floor. Right here? Yep. Come on up. You seen everything you... Oh yeah, this is where we came down. I didn't see any other steps up down there though, so that means that other one that went down isn't connected. And we only came in over here. Yeah, we have to do that side. The Cove Cinema. We came in that door. Huh? We came in that door. We came in here? Yeah. I don't remember seeing the cinema. Maybe we didn't come in here. Nope. We didn't come in here. Fire exit only. We've already seen this. Okay. Yeah, let me look. Uh, no, just, okay. just look down. If you're trying to go up, Barbara. But I don't remember all this Boy Scout stuff. Oh, we haven't seen this yet. Yeah. This is just more bunks. Literally more bunks. For now. 
Oh, it's another little kitchen. Or we're on the other side of the kitchen. No, it's a different kitchen. Ice box. Just a punk room. Hmm? There's nothing there, just bunks. Get up. I'm going into the bathroom. Oh. Huh? The shower room. It's where you uh, aptly shower, shit, shave. Hmm. This way. That's a fire exit only. We gotta find our way to another Oh. They knew that you would get us lost, Barbara. They knew it. I haven't seen any arrows in so long. This is the other side of the Told you we didn't come near the Cove Cinema. There's the steps going up. Told you. You got us lost. The other side of the I know where you were over there. Oh, hold on a minute. That's where we came. Oh, big stock pots, man. Okay. You ready? Yeah. Hey, that's a lot like the stairs are going to be going up to the uh, loft in the cabin. Yeah, we are not where we went in. We are not even. Yeah. Barbara, go man the gun. Huh? Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, you got you. Yeah, you can't you can't get them around it. <laughs> See the shells? Yeah. That these shoot? Huh? They're uh pretty good size. After you watch the video, Dad, let me know. Uh, let me know what size those are. So that was everything. That was everything. All right. Well, we're all done. Uh, we walked through all of them, at least everything we could find. Barbara made it. She didn't die. <laughs> uh, we're gonna go get something to eat. Love you, Dad. Hope you had a good time watching.